hello guys good morning good afternoon good evening anywhere you are in the world you are welcome back to my youtube channel it's your boy nigeria entertainment videos i have some news updates to share with you concerning the video see me and a lot more please if you are new on this youtube channel don't forget to subscribe share my videos and click the notification icon for more videos in time of bloating content you stay updated so guys let's get to the details of the news so guys, there was a past tweet about Whiskey tweeting about the video having a frog voice and the video has turned the frog voice into reality by making an expensive chain with frog, Himole chain with frog. So guys, this chain is very, very expensive. The video has finally turned Whiskey tweet into reality. Here was a tweet. My people may could not remember saying Yangi passport. No be Baba Blue, you know the cure from voice. That was a tweet. Honey, elder brother, the wale a delicate reply on this. He said, "Turn insults into chain. Lot of love, got a love of you." So the video has turned the insult into this chain you are seeing here. So I'm going to play the video so that you see the chain. Also, the video I've put a bound on his private jet, saying that it's going to contain only five people inside i think it was just a joke it doesn't mean it so guys currently seeing the video is in atlanta let's watch the video i'll be right back Jet no more, fuck that. These dolo, bro. Yeah. yeah, from now on, max five people. See this bitch, what you talking about? to all the mothers out there god bless you all it is not easy to be a mother god bless you all singer see me compressor having a child has made 
are more empathic. So guys, let's watch the video. I'll be right back. Why are you traveling with the baby? Like, you used to be there before. You can no longer be big girl. Because, you know, everybody's looking at you and judging you. Like, oh my gosh, she has one of those. <laughs> this flight's about to be noisy. Am I going to get to sleep? So anytime I make eye contact, I'm like, sorry, sir. Sorry, ma. <laughs> it's really not funny. But to be completely candid, though, she, she did pretty good. Like, you know, I... <laughs> Yeah, except for she made a lot of those noises. Ah, ah, ah. I don't know why. Um, yeah, and also she didn't want to sleep. So I had to back her the aeroplane. I backed her the aeroplane. Yeah. Um, and then, you know, a couple people complimented her and said, Oh, she was such a good baby. So as me, she's crying. Doesn't mean that she's a bad baby. Oh, bad you going? But you know what? Having having a kid has really changed me in a way where you know how before you have kids when you see people with children in places where you are hoping for quiet, like on the plane, like on the mall, or you see people where their kids are running around and like why is she why is her baby doing like that? Why is her child running around like that? Ah, she could leave us all running. <laughs> but raising a kid actually just gives you more empathy. Makes you very empathetic because you you see you see how it goes. You know I've been begging them in the house. Sometimes I've been yelling, stop, stop. You know when you're outside, you're like, you know what? You know so it's not really about you. So now I'm I just have more empathy, I guess, because yeah, I'm wearing those shoes now. You know, like when we were at the airport, there was um this couple. They had three kids with them. The mom had a baby, like a little baby strapped to her. And then there were two other boys with the daddy. And this man kept chasing this, this the middle little child. She and Mary, she and Mary, come here. Ah, she and Mary, come here. She was a, hold your brother. She was a, hold your brother. She and Mary, come here. Why are you crying? Stop crying. In immigration, I was like, <laughs> before, me or before, be like, uh-uh. Talk to them now. <laughs> I felt so sorry for them. I was like, yo. I was like, yo. I was like, yo. So, I mean, I'm, I think I'm doing this so you can... Sometimes, you see, it's not because people are trying to have rowdy kids. Sometimes, it just be like that. So, before I go away for the day, I just wanted to tell you that you're perfect. Just the way you are. I think I was good. Mommy. So guys, what is your opinion on what Simi is saying? Is it true that um, having a kid, that um, in some people you have more empathy? Please, if you have anything to say, drop it in the comment section below. That is what Simi is saying about herself. So guys, there are some people in this life when I saw um, a pastor make a comment, a video about people that help outside people, but their family are really, really suffering. So if you are in that shoe, please stop it. Make sure you help your family members, especially your siblings, your parents. Make sure you help them very well before you look outside. Don't be generous outside and be a bad person inside. That is very bad. So people are like that. They are good in outside, but very bad inside their family. So guys, this pastor make a point on this video. Let's watch the video. I'll be right back. Mama is still carrying wood in the village and the man is here giving donations to churches. I'm not against it. But make sure that in all your lifting, you do not forget those who helped you. There are many people who do not take care of their families. But sometimes you come to us as men of God and you bless us with millions whereas the family members are suffering. It ought not to be so. So guys, that is a news update I wanted to share. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe, share my videos and stay tuned for my next update. Thank you for your support for new subscribers and unsubscribers. I really appreciate Stay tuned. I'll be right back.